I have three dollars and seventy-four cents. Do something to me. I love you. I want to take you away from all of this. Did any of you watch the George Floyd trial? Or, I'm sorry, the Derek Chauvin trial? If you did, you would have seen that there were plenty of angles that showed Mr. Chauvin's knee was actually not on George Floyd's neck at all. There were two selected photos that were plastered all over, well, you know, photos and videos that were plastered all over the, um, all over the place, which depicted something that was kind of like a bit of a magic eye and everyone fell into it and screamed, oh my goodness, this is such a tragedy, why, why, why? And at the end of the day, we kind of threw Derek Chauvin under the bus and said, ha, huh, yes, racism solved. America's, America's better off. We're all good here. Well, guys, if you are unfamiliar with the gentleman who's on screen right now, he go, well, went by the name of Patrick LaLoya. He uh, tragically lost his life in an encounter with the police in Grand Rapids, uh, Michigan earlier in this week. And well, the circle of life repeats itself as there have been tons of protests and, oh my goodness, let's start the revolution and defund the police and all this other fun stuff has all popped off again. Guys, the important thing about life is learning your lessons. So, I couldn't help but notice that a couple of content creators, uh, Matt Christensen and um, Donut Operator, had covered the encounter with police that, you know, has all of your usual suspects, your Al Sharptons, your Benjamin Crumps, uh, screaming, oh my goodness, America, oh, so racism, my goodness, he died because he was black, he died because he was black. Guys, uh, Matt Christensen... You're a godsend, brother. Here is the footage. Car! Stay in the car! Dude, I'm stopping you. Do you have a license? What? Do you have a license? What? I'm stopping you. Do you have a license? What? How do you know? The plate doesn't belong in this car. So, anybody with two eyes can see that this man, it seems as if he does not understand the, 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 the words that are coming out of the mouth of the police officer here. Meaning, it, it, like, okay, so a little background on Mr. Laola. He is a Congolesean ref. He was a Congolesean refugee, um, of, uh, father of two sons, and um, he had a few run-ins with the police. Charges dropped, particularly when it comes to stealing cars and like. But the reason uh, that the police officer is pulling them over is because the cop, the the tags and the car don't match, which. I hate to break this to you guys, but no matter if you're white, black, green, blue, or purple, if your tags and your car don't match, that is a, a more than enough reason for the police to pull you over. All right? I, like, this has absolutely literally zero to do with the gentleman here being of a certain pigment. Instead of grabbing his driver's license as he said he would, Leoya then closes the car door and starts walking away, and a physical struggle ensues. Leoya. So here's the thing. There's going to be a lot of people who want to sit here and be like, that's not resisting. Guys, it is. That's resisting. Instead of sitting there and, and, fo and just following the police officer's instructions, and hey, if there is an issue, you take it to court. Plain and simple. If you're, if, if, I don't care if you're an American or an immigrant, just take it to court. All right. But in, while you are in the presence of the, of, of the police officer, they, by all means, it, it is what it is. You can either sit there, you can either make this a very quick thing, or it's going to sit there and play on out. And well, we make our, we all got our choices to make now, don't we? And runs and due to his pants around his thighs and his efforts to hold them up he's not very fast and the officer catches and tackles him and the officer gains control of leoya and tries to bring him over to the police car but leoya keeps fighting after a fight that has now lasted about 90 seconds the so that's a full minute and a half and you see the taser come out right here because guys whether you want to admit it or not this is resisting it is okay when the second you are non-compliant particularly in such a physical uh manner yeah you're not res you are resisting sir then draws his taser and as he's trying to use it 
Lugoya grabs the taser and fights for it. This fight brings the two to the ground. At this point, the officer's body cam turns off. Police say that's because some pressure on it hit the off button for three seconds. But Lugoya's passenger recording on his cell phone captures the rest of the encounter. An underrated piece of this footage is the commentary from Lugoya's friend as he records. No, you're misunderstanding. He's not resisting at all. Not resisting. <laughs> No, you're good. You're not resisting nothing, bro. Taser? What taser? I have no idea what you're talking about. Don't pull the taser! No, he ain't got no taser. I see it. Wait, have you tried just talking with him? Because he's a very good listener. No, he's good, bro. Like, can you talk to him like good? Like, can you? Yeah. No. I'm not Congolesian. That is not my culture. This, like, like I, I, I do believe that there is a certain element of cultural clash that's taken place here. But this is def. That's definitely not the officer's problem because the officer is in America and he would expect to be dealing with someone who can who 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 understands the circumstances that they're in. Uh, according to reports, uh, Mr. Leola, 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 whatever, got here in uh, 2014, you know, which is about eight years or so. You know, we're in 2020, it's 2022 right, right now, so it's about eight years or so. And guys, I mean, when you come here, there are, like, there's a reason... America is as it is, and a lot of it has to do with our laws. Um, that, and that's not me sitting here simping for uh, the legal system at all. I trust me. I see the flaws. I want to work on them. But this is a uh, this is um, real talk. A big part. Of this this is a big tragedy that can happen due to such a gigantic cultural shift. I mean, the dude was from the Congo. Like he good, like you can talk to him, bro. But the trouble is, the officer has tried just talking for several minutes now to decreasing effects, not better. And no matter what the play-by-play -play commentary says, from this guy's cell phone angle, you can clearly see Leoya's hand strongly gripping the taser and fighting the officer for it. The struggle for the taser lasted something close to another 90 seconds after the officer drew it. Throughout the struggle, the officer had his right hand on the taser. At some point in the struggle, his right hand loses grip on it. The officer issues repeated commands to let go of the taser, but Leoya does not. Let go of the taser! Let go of the taser! And when the officer loses control of the taser, he takes his right hand, grabs his pistol, and shoots Leoya in the back of the head. And I don't use still frames to try to hide or misrepresent anything. It's just that there are certain things that Queen Susan Wiki Wiki doesn't like us peasants showing on YouTube. The f Matt, you're a gym, bro. Keep doing what you, keep doing what it is that you do, but. Well, we just sat here and watched uh, Matt Christensen. Matt, hold on, Matt Christensen's uh, uh, coverage of it. But let's go to uh, AJ. AJ Plus. Hold on. I'm stuck. you read this right i mean uh, this like we just watched for a, a, a very shortened um version of these exact same events and here they are using like really just hold on hold on let's go to the front let's go to the front of this a police officer kicked and then shot a black man during a traffic stop we just w sat there and we just watched this traffic stop right like we just watched him resist 130 percent of the way we just watched this man try to go for the police officer's taser and here's the thing if he he, if he incapacitates the police uh the police officer guess what he now has access to that police officer's gun there is literally uh, uh, the color had absolutely nothing to do with this action had everything to do with this guys but and, and and that's the reason why I wanted to highlight um AJ plus because you can see they just they they just ran through it and now there's all these protests and I want to just get into a little bit of the uh protest coverage because that is uh hold on cuz these folks are like you're just an embarrassment at this point Ah come on there we go 
This is being such a pain in the butt. Alright, so that's the one from Grand Rapids. Here we go. It shut down the streets. More uh, BLM and far right uh, protesting. Can't stop the revolution. Yes, the, the, all this for what we just witnessed, guys. Oh, oh, an awful. Okay, uh, I don't know. This is just another uh, BLM protest in Wilkinsburg, uh, Pennsylvania. Where black cops are uh, having to deal with this, this, this nonsense. Where are you? Where are you all? Where are you all speaking? Right here. Right here. Yes, the fuck we are. It is our fucking right. It is. It is freedom of yes. It is our right. It is our right. Boys, 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 boys. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, guys, guys. This is this is why we need to really get the women back in line. Because this is, I mean, I don't know if we could put this toothpaste back in the um damn tube, but it's about time we acknowledge that the toothpaste is out of the tube and do the, do our best to try to siphon it back in there because this is ridiculous. Right. It is our right. It is our right. Our freedom of speech. We can march and we can say what the fuck we want. Black lives you matter. Don't point at Black me. Black lives matter. Come on. Black matter. Black matter. Nice boys. <laughs> and this oh and this this is even more fun in Pittsburgh. Holy shit, hold on. to you hold on hold on hold on because 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 is that what they did hold on let me make sure <laughs> i can guarantee you they, 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 that's probably <laughs> Goodness, boys, I'm telling you, the like now I'm at a point where I, I, I just don't care anymore. I mean, however, the police need to 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 really knock some sense into these folks. By all means, also for you ain't gonna get no complaints from me because it, it's it it really is just feminism's feminism and um, these made up matriarchies that we have here in these uh, all, all these very urban communities, right? You know what I'm saying? Democratically run all urban communities. It, it was like a, feminism's been the Trojan horse and now things are just, 
in, in, in certain places, in certain areas, just really like out of control and whatever means in which the police or the government or whoever in charge of these areas um, have to get that control back. I mean, I'm all for it. If the cops come out with tear gas and start busting y'all down, particularly um, so long after the BLM bullshit, man, I'm with it, bro. I'm 130% with it. So, guys, with that being said, we're going to bring this one to an end. All the internet stuff. If you like it, toss it a like. Dislike, go ahead, do that too. Don't be scared of you. Stop. Enjoy my fantastic voice. And when you get videos like this every single day, share because sharing is scaring. And YouTube and bitch, you can like. Aren't the biggest fans of your boy over here for very obvious reasons. Bang the bell for notifications. Get something from Teespring. Check me out on Odyssey as well. Links in the description. I to go in the description box and do damage and speak. Let me know. What do you guys think in the comments? Uh, Yeah, all this for the Patrick Leola dude. Like, we just watched. We, we watched how it went down. Dude resisted the entire time and acted like either acted like or really couldn't just understand simple directions and simple instructions. And that that's absolutely nothing to sit there and, uh, you know, saying spaz out over or spurg out over, particularly when none of y'all knew this asshole. But um, no, 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 no. That's not what it's about. What it's about is continuing to fester these um, radical and very selfish, communistic and um, evil in many ways, ideas, you know what I'm saying, I can guarantee you, we looking at a whole bunch of Disney fucking fans, I can guarantee you, we looking at a whole bunch of people who, you know what I'm like, just NPCs at this point, who refuse, or who either can't or don't want to look further into things before they go, and like, these people just have a, a, a lack of impulse control, I think that's probably the nicest way that I could put it, guys, let me know what you think in the comments, though, and until the next one. See what makes you cheer. Every breath I take without your permission raises my self-esteem.